It's the first agricultural empowerment of the Alaji Sani Naji Foundation and its use or local government is where they're starting from. The foundation has set aside motorcycles, bags of fertilizer, maize and cotton seedlings to be distributed to 1,200 subsistence farmers who will be upgrading to commercial farming. While the farmers are seated, the board members and the Enugu State Commissioner for Agriculture who is on ground to witness the empowerment inspects the items for distribution. The Commissioner is impressed with what the Foundation is doing and he pledges his commitment to help the farmers achieve their goals. I want to sound it very clear to the farmers. The ball is in your court. Every necessary agronomic practices you need to produce cotton and maize will be given to you. It's time for the distribution of the farming inputs and each of the 1,200 farmers were given maize and cotton seedlings, fertilizers and money to farm a minimum of one hectare of land, a gesture they are grateful for. Friday Foundation, helping me out, and not just helping me in agriculture, but of course introducing me to another sphere, a specialty that, that was hit to unknown to me. Now I'm going into maize farm. After maize farm, during the midst of rainy season, I was still going to cotton. So I'm elated. I'm happy. The foundation has also created ready markets to buy off the products and ensure immediate income for the farmers. They are giving 70%, 75%, while the farmer will produce 25%. And afterwards, the foundation will go in to buy it at the prevailing market price, no matter the quantity you produce. For the leader of the foundation, the organization is ready to replicate their gesture in the other 16 local governments of the state and ensure jobs for the teeming population. We have a lot of unemployed youths. This is the only opportunity where they can come in, key into this program, and then have another source of life. The maze we are giving today is going to give us five tons per hectare. If we will start with 1,200 people this season, I believe next season we will be getting more than 10,000 people. The foundation also appointed supervisors who were given motorbikes to monitor the farmers and provide needed support. <laughs> 